Do you? Hello. Welcome to stream. I am dressed for the occasion. I have on some very, like, summery clothes right now. I don't know if I can show this really quick. I have summery clothes. <laughs> yeah. I, I like them. They're fun. They're fun. Uh, we're playing more Mario Sunshine. I, I showed this image on stream yesterday. There's more of these somewhere. I need to go find them, but they're, they're, there's a collection of Catholic Marios. Um, let's get the game open. This song is Serena Beach from uh, Super Mario Sunshine. Oh, I need to plug it. There we go. Oh no, the next song is playing. No. The Gorpulous Adventures of Cat of oh, Dog Girl Mario. Yes. Okay. What song is playing right now? Tina Park Beach. I really love this song. This song's so nice. Okay. Oh. go. I don't know if I should get rid of the, uh, the webcam or not. I don't know. We'll have chat vote on it. Can I do slash poll? You shouldn't. Started poll. Let's find out. Uh, my friend Ava brought me Burnout Paradise yesterday. Her copy of Burnout Paradise for, uh, what is it? For PS3 yesterday. And I had a really fun time playing it, I'm not gonna lie. I was not expecting that, because I, I don't usually, like, really get into car games, but it was very fun. It's a really neat game. So I just realized we haven't gone and gotten that shine, so I'm gonna go get that. I really love the rocket nozzle, it's so fun. People not like this game. We're keeping it? Okay. One day Hilda will play an actually good car game. Crush car, you say? As in Crush? That video game I like? played Garfield Kart. The first game is miserable, but they made a sequel called Furious Racing, and that's actually, like, a pretty good game. I, I really like Garfield Kart Furious Racing. I need to play that game more. I had a really fun time playing it when I played it. My friend got it for me as, like, a joke, but as somebody who likes, uh, car games to an extent... Or like uh, karting games. I like I like racing games. I 
I need to get up there. I didn't grab the shine. I went in Pianta Village. I'm so tired. The Gloopy Inferno. Damn it. <laughs> oh, shoot. I had the, the hover nozzle. I didn't even realize that. That could have made that so much easier, but no, I thought I still had the rocket nozzle. <laughs> I forgot to go practice the rocket nozzle thing. For, uh, just, what is it? That one place. Oh my god, I can't remember. Gelato Beach! Oh my god, it's such a lot of beach skip. Oh. <laughs> Mario bounces face first into that and, like, gets his neck snapped. Gorked up? Oh yeah. You know it. <laughs> I like watching the mechanics of Flood Move. Whenever you're using them. You know something? I don't think I know what the last mission of Serena Beach is. I might go do that. To be honest. Yeah, I'm gonna go do that. Hmm, yes, most excellent. Red coins in the hotel. Oh, this is gonna be really easy then. <laughs> I can go to do that. I feel like Serena Beach is the most whatever world. To be honest. I was- like, every- every mission I've ever done in this level has always been really hard. And by that I mean the first two are. They've always given me trouble. It's a really weird area. Oh, I have- I have a timer? Oh. Okay, well that makes things a little bit different. Oh no, they can be in other rooms, too. Bad news, everyone. I might die here. Come on! Come on, Marmio! Wow, these are really garbage stalls. Ew. The price for pay to Serena. Why doesn't Mario simply leave the island? Because this is what he has to do! Hmm. I need to do all the blue coins here too, don't I? Are all these locked? I think they're locked. So at least we're good on that. I really love this game. This game owns. 
Okay, so we're at 5 out of 8, and I don't see any more. There's an issue. They do not give all the red coins missions a timer. Because they have, a. Uh... What is it? They have... What level is it? Bianco Hills. Oh, are they in here? Oh, no. Gorpa, Gorpa. They very well may be in here. Ooh. A bloin? Just for me. You know what this gives me vibes of? It gives me vibes of, uh... Mario and Luigi Partners in Time. Like the... Uh, what is it? The vent area? In the Vim Factory? That's what this reminds me of. Also, I don't think that there are any up here. I just wasted so much time. Where are the last three? Oh, there's another one. You know, while I'm here, I might as well. I don't think Plock would ever be bound by some meaningless timer. <clears throat> Plock would just, like, go into the negatives of the timer. Where the hell are these last three coins? <laughs> Chad, care to help? Actually, wait, I have an idea of where one might be. Oh. The Boo statue isn't there anymore. Interesting that they got rid of that. Hmm. There's one in there! Wait! How do I get that? Wait, no. Huh? There are ones in the rooms. Oh no, chat. It's- it's so Jover for me. No. Let me up there. Let me up there. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's so Super Mario over. Why does that sound like an epic rap battles of history thing? I was in there! Thank you! This sucks. You know what? I've accepted my fate. I'm gonna just go for this blue coin over here. No, 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 no. <laughs> Good morning, Lucy. Hello, John the FM. Hello, you two. Have either of you two seen uh, Dog Girl Mario yet? Have either of you two seen this? Just wondering. My hit post on, on Twitter.com. No, but very cool. Thank you. I love her too. Yeah. Okay, so that sucked. I, that did not go as well as I planned. <gasps> I just realized. I just realized. I just remembered something. I remembered a feature of this game that I totally forgot about until literally just now. Every secret mission has a second version of it where you get to do red coins in it. I totally forgot about that until just now. 
By the way, my new GameCube sticks should be coming in soon. So that's exciting. I'll finally have a decent working stick. I ever told you guys the story of how I got this GameCube controller? My friend Mark, who used to be one of my neighbors, um, he, he lived like two houses down. And we, we hung out a lot. And he was like a few years older than me. And uh, there were like $5 in this cup that I had on my desk when he came over one day. He was like, he kept looking over at it. And I was like, dude, what are you doing? I, I was literally like five at this point. And he was like, no, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. And one day, that $5 went missing. And my mom got really angry because she knew that it was probably him who stole it. And so a few days later, I come over to his house. And I'm like, I I'm, I, I, I don't care, really. Because I, I thought he was, I thought he was cool. He had a Nintendo 64. I thought that was awesome. And so I was like, hey. Um, can I play Nintendo 64? And he was like, yeah. And so we played N64 and we played Smash Bros. And he was eventually like, hey, I'm sorry for taking your five dollars. Uh, I'll give you something if you want. And I was like, okay, because I I didn't care. It was five dollars. And so he was like, uh, well, I've got this Game Boy here. And he gives me this, like, magenta, like, translucent plastic Game Boy Advance. And I was like, oh my god, wow, okay. And then he was like, well, that's probably not enough. I'll, I'll give you, uh, The Legend of Zelda Oracle of Seasons, too. And then he ended up giving me, like, five different things. He gave me a Game Boy Advance. Not an SP, just a Game Boy Advance. Um... A copy of Legends of the Oracle of Seasons, a copy of Super Smash Brothers Melee, and a GameCube controller. And that is how I own this controller. I wonder what that goober's up to now. Wonder what he's up to. Uh, to be honest, it was kind of a ripoff for him. Five things for five dollars to atone for his sins. That was four things, Eki. Are there anything back here? No, there are no coins back there. We're good. Me melee is worth two sins. Ah! I can't, I can't boost, I can't boost, I can't boost. part about all of that was that he didn't give me a second GameCube controller. So I was stuck playing the single play player of Melee without a memory card for like five years. And then I eventually got one. Mario laughs so jovially. <laughs> the memory cards, like, the concept of a memory card is so cool to me. I could not tell you why. It's such an archaic way of storing data, but I love it. I love it so much. I love collecting memory cards. I have, like, 80 of them. I have, like, a collection of memory cards. So I just think that they're so neat. Do not ever get me into dream Dreamcast collecting, or else I will collect every single VMU on the planet. <laughs> Mark.
Mark, if you're in chat, reveal yourself. Hilda gets the Godzilla VMU? That's a thing? Oh my god. It is. I want this so bad. Oh. Hold on, let me add a display capture so I can show you this. That's the wrong thing. Check this out. I want that. I want that so bad. Oh my god. <laughs> That's awesome. Uh, mm. I, I honestly don't know what console I want to collect for next. I want either a Sega Saturn, a Neo Geo, or a Dreamcast. It's a really hard choice. I don't know what I'm going to save my money up for next. Because I, I love all three of those consoles. I think they're super neat. It's just that the Dreamcast has no games that I want. The only ones that I want are either unreleased or... Um... Well, actually, wait. There's another Dreamcast game that I really like. That I have in my ROMs folder. I mean, uh... No, I, it has Wetrix. It has Wetrix. That's what it is. It has all the, uh... Godzilla VMU in the other corner. Okay. Pressing the B key makes Bowser appear. That's the issue. Right? So whenever I press the B key, that's why it does that. Bowser jump scare? There's a Hello Kitty Dreamcast? There is? There's a Hello Kitty VMU? Oh my god! There's a Hello Kitty Dreamcast controller? Chat? I know what I'm saving up for. Oh my god, this thing looks so good, actually. Ooh, this is like... Okay, look it up. It's like the exact, like, translucent pink plastic that my Game Boy Advance that I got from Mark was. Which one of these gives you a blue coin? There it is. <laughs> yeah, this one isn't giving me anything. Could have sworn that it was symmetrical, right? No? Really? Really? I just do seem to recall there being another blue coin around back. Have your grandma pull the car around. I don't know if I mentioned this before, but I started re reading this manga called Ping Pong. And it's phenomenal. Um, I really want to get back into Ping Pong now. I used to be really good at it. I got like a ping pong table for my for Christmas one year. I got really into ping pong for like three weeks. Because it was a really fun thing to do. I like weird sports. What can I say?
Oh, shoot. Wait, look at these guys over here. Wait, I've never seen this before. These guys are so fun. Do the doot doot dance, or else I'll kill you. I actually really like seeing these people just walking around and having a good time. This is really neat. Oh, you know what? There's a life I need to go get really quick. Because I'm playing Mario games, I need to go get a life. <laughs> This one, it is this one. That's the life I uh, grinded for lives on. On my personal file. Because it's like one of the easiest lives to get in the game. <laughs> oh, this is the wrong mission. No worries, no worries. Okay, well, now I know where most of them are. Yeah! Oh, there's none in the so Wait. Yes! That was kind of cool, actually. Hey, it was all worth it. Come on. There we go. Good news, everyone. I did it. What was the point of this? This does nothing for me. I don't think. Unless I can hop in there? Maybe? I know I can. See? Oh. <laughs> okay, you know what? Screw this room. This room sucks. We're going up here. Oh. Hello. Ah. No, I'm gaming. Trust me. So that's more than I've gotten before. Er, is it? No, because I, I got s There's one more that I'm missing somewhere. Where is it? Oh, there it is. I see it. I see it. Hmm, okay. I'm, I'm swiftly running out of time. See, there's an issue. There's an issue, gang. Oh no. How do I get into the vents again? Chat, no. Not like this. Oh no. Oh! That's how. Wait, no, this just leads me back up here! How do I get into the vents from here? Are there any of these doors I can go through at all?
No, there's this one over here that I can go into. There appears to be a fish you. Could not have said it better myself, eh, he? Okay, I see an opportunity and I take it. I swear to god, if this takes me to the hot tub room, I'm gonna cry. Thank god. Uh, please? No! See, now this is not ideal. I was expecting myself to be able to go through that portrait right there. Hmm. Everyone? There's, there's a fish you. Okay, how do I get into that room? Do I go into that poster? How do I get into this room? By doing that. What room is that? Oh no. I can't go into any room. This sucks. Well. Awesome. I'm gonna go in the bathroom really quick. I'll be right back. Hi guys! Two webcams. It's two different angles. On the back of Dog Girl Mario's head is a Godzilla VMU. That's why there's a white background in both of them. Oh shoot, I gotta hydrate. Huh. Okay, so here's the deal, right? The different lenses as well, yeah. I'm letting Tori Living borrow some of the cameras for it. I just had to run up and down the stairs like three times. I'm gonna try not to sniffle very much. Imagining a streamer that has like four different angles 
of themselves in a stream layout. I never had that, but what I did have was on one of my streams one time, I had like this dead. I was doing like speedruns and stuff, and I had this little like dead zone in the bottom right that had just nothing in it, and I was like, I'm just gonna point my webcam at my PS2 while I do this. And so I had PS2 cam, and I was like, what if I have two different views of it? And so I got out a second webcam and did that. You know what? I could do that right now. Hold on. Hold up. I've got another... I've got another webcam. I'm really hoping that this doesn't like overload all of everything on my computer. No. Come on. It's giving me the option. Hilda neck. It's giving me the option to select the webcam, but nothing actually appears out of it. That's very odd. Let me try... Let me try this. Hold up, wait. Oh, my PS2. No. All the cables are so caught on everything. No. There we go. That's really dark. <laughs> No, 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 wait, 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 wait. I got my book light. Yeah! <laughs> the cube view. That looks really scary. <laughs> <laughs> Ominous. Okay, hold on. The uncanny cube. <laughs> See, look, this isn't a picture either. Here's my hand. <laughs> oh shoot, my my AV capture card froze because I plugged something into my uh my USB hub. Uh oh. It's not happy. Please don't crash my computer this time. Please. Uh. Please don't crash my computer. Come on, AV to USB. Come on. Come on. You can do it. Come on. Please. Well, my AV capture card stopped working. I could use a different USB hub. Hold on.
Because that one's always really finicky. Let's try this one. Oh. One of the things in the USB hub broke off. No, it's not Blank Hilda Stream. Shut up. No, it's not. Let's try this one. Okay. Well... I've got a better idea. I've got a better idea. Audio only stream. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Check this out. I'm gonna fix this. Let me unscrew these extenders from my AV capture card for the first time in years. Ah! I feel like I just broke it. Uh, plug this in. Hold on, wait, let me move where my GameCube is a little bit closer. Plug those in right there. Oh my god, is this gonna actually work? Huh. Good news, everyone, I think it might work. AV to USB 2.0. Come on. Come on. Oh, yes! It worked! <laughs> it worked! My idea worked. The game is back. Me inhaling my cube because of how uncanny this is. Yes! It's back! Mario's back, baby! He's not dead! Okay, awesome stream. I plugged it directly into my computer instead of using the extender cables because, I mean, I'm not worried about looking at the TV now. So I don't need the splitters, so we're fine. Okay, so now I'm just exploring around. So I'm trying to make sure I know where I'm going. So, like, what's the plan here? Oh, you had a TV- you had a camera just pointed at the TV screen? No. I- I'm not stooping to that level yet. I have done that before. That was a- an idea I considered. What's going on in this room, huh? I'm 
when I was a kid, I thought that everyone recorded game footage like that, and some people were just better at crapping out the corners. Me too! Me too, actually. I so unbelievably thought that. This hotel is a little bit scary. How do I get to places? I love, like, the noir. I love the noir. The noir, like, uh... Lighting I have on my GameCube. It looks like a min. It looks like a Midnight Crew screenshot. Let me in. Let me into the hole. Let me in. You're right. Thank you. I'm begging you though. Please, I need to get into this. How are you supposed to get in? I don't think this is the intended way. I'm just trying to do this because it's funny. I would hope this isn't the intended way. You don't enter that. Okay, so... If not, how do I get into that room? Otherwise, I'm trying to think about my options here. Awesome. So I can go into this room, which takes me up there. Which does mean that there's obviously something over here. So is it this? It is this. Good to know. Are there any red coins in here, I wonder? Okay, so now I know how to do things. I can imagine, at least. I want that one. I want this one. Now I leave. Now I go up here. Oh, there was actually there was actually an extra one that I totally forgot about. That I got last time by doing this. Nice. Superb. Okay, you grab that and then leave through this door. That red switch releases some kind of neurotoxin in the hotel. You know what? It probably does. That's why it kills you when it runs out. You think the same thing works with uh, il piantissimo. Do you think that's why it kills you when you lose in that race? He like attaches a bomb to you that only kills you and does no collateral damage. Microaggression grenade. Let me in here. Okay. What is this? Oh. Is there a coin? No coins? No coins. Super Mario Bomb Collar. True. Give me that. Il Piantissimo kills you with his mind. Okay, where's the last one? Oh no, I'm so close. Please don't make me lose now. Is it in here? Yes! 
That was actually really easy. There was some real good zinger I was gonna say earlier once I finished this, but I can't remember what it was now. Yummy red coin. Super Mario- I keep looking over at chat and seeing Super Mario Bomb Collar. That's what Dog Girl Mario wears! Wait! I didn't think about that. Eight coins in the hotel? Uh, yeah, I sure hope they are! I, I don't get it. Is that like a reference to the Drew Gooden thing? So I do get that. I didn't watch a whole lot of Vine as a kid. Not as a kid, like when I was younger. But, I do know about Drew Gunn. Dog Girl Mario sounds like she's had a hard life. I mean, a bomb collar would do that to you. No, no, no. It's a, it's a bomb collar that, that only, like, that's been, like, deactivated. So it's like a cool fashion statement sort of thing. Bomb collar shoots out bombs. Yeah, exactly. Like that. Okay, so that's everything... Oh, wait, no, I still need to go do the red coins and uh, the other secret missions. What, we're 50 minutes into this and I've just now gotten my second shine, I'm pretty sure? Making real good progress here, Hilda. Spent too long trying to get your AV capture card to work. Okay, let's go do this. I'll do 100 coins and I'll be done with Serena Beach. Well, actually, no, there's a second one in the one with the blocks and all that. Mm -hmm. Bonk. That was a very delayed bonk. The Bob-omb collar. Everybody. Think about the bo think about the bob bombs in this game. Think about them right now. They're very neat looking. They're like little wind up toys. I like how they look in this game a lot. Oh yeah, I had a dream the other night where I had lockjaw. I always felt sorry for the bombs. They always have the sentient eyes. You're kind of right. I don't like them exploding. I had a dream where I had... You wouldn't last a day in my shoes. Oh no. I think that whatever I had in that dream was Lockjaw. I don't know what the definition of Lockjaw is. Actually, now that I think about it, is it where, like, your jaw just gets, like, stuck? Because if so, that's what it was. Maybe I had it, like, in my sleep, and I was just, like... Because it felt very real. Same goes for Creepers. I mean, I don't think this relationship for work is, for, is- I don't think this relationship is working for either of us who- You can just not explode in my house if you wanna. Yeah. I think creepers should just, like, be nicer. Huh. Lockjaw does sound like a DKC enemy. Oh, I only have like a minute to do this. I just realized that. I like these ice blocks. They look really cool. Lol. There's no way. There's no way! Ah! 
This isn't Pikmin. You're right, it isn't. I will be streaming Pikmin 4 when it comes out. I need to stream Pikmin 3 first. But... Pikmin 4 will happen. There will be a Pikmin 4 stream. So awesome. Oh, I already like you. Welcome to chat, by the way. Oh, no, no, it's all wrong. It's all wrong. I'm totally gonna run out of time before I can even get this done. It's so Mario over. Ah. Come down to that ledge, please. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god, it wouldn't let me hover there for a second. I got so scared. Where's the last coin? Where's the last coin? Where's the last coin? Where's the last coin? Where is it? No! What? Where is it? I don't know how this happened, but I've apparently been following it since October. Yeah, I noticed that it didn't say, uh, first, it didn't say first chat message. Where was the last coin? There is no last coin? No. Oh, hey, you know what, actually? Hold on, wait, I got a Pikmin. I got a Pikmin. For you. Hold on, wait. Can I, like... Can I get the second webcam text in here? It's really loud, I'm sorry. Very important Pikmin cam. By the way, the only way I can look at the stream now because of how I have to set up my AV capture card, it is- I still- I, I have to see the- both webcams now. I didn't mean to select that one. I'm just gonna get the live and then save and quit. Was there one up top? Is that what it was? I think it was. I'm pretty sure you can create a, create a preview window of just the webcam. Yeah, I know. But I don't feel like it. I mean, yeah, I probably should do that. I mean... I don't know, it wouldn't hurt. Did I already get all the... Oh, I still have to do Gelato 8, don't I? Okay... Chat, it's time to go do, uh, do Gelato Beach. You know what I could do? I could do Gelato Beach skip. No. I still want to do the cool thing with Gelato. The watermelon mission. Yeah, it's not that bad once you realize you can kill the Cataquacks. It's just that last pier that gets really annoying. I didn't know you could kill the Cataquax until like a few days ago though. Or more like a few weeks ago, but when I was first doing this like... Casually. Again. I 
I don't know. Watermelon Mich Mission makes for good content on like 2008 YouTube, but it's not that bad in retrospect. Okay, so I, I've been practicing my, I, I don't know, I've been practicing my, uh, my rocket cancels off stream a little bit. I was trying to do one there. I know that it looked like me just doing literally nothing and being very, like, quiet for a few seconds. Trust me, there were things going on there. I just couldn't do it. So it's this mission. The watery, or the fiery inferno. There's a pretty, or no, the Goopy Inferno. Fiery Inferno are like, very repetitive words. Oh, you swine. Okay, so I was planning on doing the damage boost thing, but uh, I forgot. Just a reminder that that is not, in fact, a still image. That is a real picture. So what you're supposed to do for this mission is go underneath the town and all that. But there's always been something way cooler that I had in mind. Um, and a lot of people have done this. It's doing this. It's doing the, like, water strat. Where you can, like, delete sections of the inferno by jumping out of this with a spin jump. Like that. Ow! That was a lot of two hits. See, we are good. Okay. I don't know why I went over this way. This is a bad idea. Oof. I think Mario should just use Flood for this level. Okay, well I see where I want to go. Now the question is, can I make it over there? And not be super dead? Can I jump on these guys first? <gasps> you wouldn't dare do that to me, would you? <coughs> I need to <coughs> sneeze. I'm so sorry. See, we're good. We're fine. That was perfect. That was actually really good. Wow. Maybe I shouldn't have deleted that. Okay. See, we're fine. thing you can do where you can delete these instantly by doing a spam spray as you're like ground pounding. Oh, but I can't do it because I'm really bad at it. I think Mario should become 128 miniature versions of himself, but we can't all get what we want from Mario. You're right. We just have to live with that. Which sucks. Zoom's like made a video about this level. I think that's pretty cool. I love Zoom's like so much. Thanks, a bundle. 
Gantha Village is such a cool area. It's got all these like mushrooms and stuff. And it's it's one of the only areas at night, I'm pretty sure. I think it is the only area at night. Which is awesome. I love that. Ooh. Did you guys hear that? That was like my entire back cracking. Shine! Chain Chomp's back. Oh, it's a rehash of another level. <laughs> Mario, you should get an evil variant. Have I got news for you? Let's break all of our bones. Have you guys seen the Tumblr account, Evil Mario 666? I constantly get that account, like, recommended to me. Like, all the time. I think Mario should smoke and drink alcohol and wear all black. Wow. That would be cool. Isn't this a thing? Yes, it is. I know that because I watched speedruns of 120 Shine. So where's... <clears throat> I have heard of Evil Mario 666. Okay, so it's like I I don't follow them because I don't know. I just don't find it to be that. It's not really my thing, but it's like a, I I I can't tell if it's a parody account or not. It's hard to tell. There are blue coins over here. There should be. No. Oh, there should be blue coins in one of these. It really is hard to tell. Though. Blue coins are evil Mario coins. I like the blue coin mechanic. Is that just me being extremely weird? I know that a lot of people don't like blue coins, but I love them. I think they're super neat. I should grab those. Oh. That sucks, actually. I don't know, I've never played Sunshine. Sunshine is really good. I love this game. This is one of the first- I think this was the first GameCube game I owned besides Melee. Which we've already gone over how I obtained that. Hello, Chain Chomp. My controller's shaking so much. You know what? I got an idea. I've got a better idea. In the famous words of Simple Flips. Simple Flips' real name is Eddie. Which honestly just makes so much sense. He does look like an Eddie. Alright. No. That wasn't- that didn't go how it was supposed to go. No. You swine. Come on. Okay, never mind. So I, I've seen 
uh, certain people do this mission in a very interesting way. Where they grab the water barrel and wait for the chomp to run into it over here. Speaking of which, I need to refill my water. Wow. Oh shoot, the watermelons. Yo! It's these things. It's always really weird seeing these in just like a normal area in the game. This mission sucks. I never really got all that into Kirby's Air Ride, by the way. I don't know, it was never really my game. It does look good. Like, I don't know. Ooh. Yes! Nice! No. Come on. Get over here. Very nice. Oh! I thought I died in the cutscene. Is there a mission where you file your taxes? Uh, yeah. Called. Oh, I, need think of, I need to think of a funny one. By the way, look, there's my ABBA wallpaper. There's ABBA. I should move my mouse. It's called I Just Feel Like a Purple Pikmin. I love Super Mario Sunshine. Secret of the Village Underside. Oh, I remember this one. This one's actually really cool. Because you get to go down on those mushrooms down there. You know what? Isn't there a way you can do this without Yoshi? Hold on. These mushrooms look so cool. For some reason, nighttime areas in games always make me feel nostalgic. I can't pinpoint why. There's some way you can do this without, uh, without Yoshi, though, I know that. Switch to the hover nozzle. No, it wouldn't let me jump. I don't know how to do it. I'm just gonna do it the normal way. I always like to try. Oh wait, hold on. There's a there's a glitch I want to show really quick. I just realized I can go do that now. I feel like a side of beef. That's what I was trying to reference earlier when I saw I feel like a purple Pikmin. It's that one clip of Fred from Scooby-Doo saying I feel like a side of beef and he's like hung up by a hook. Okay, okay so what you do is you do this, I think. Yeah, now you're inside the crate. I used to love this as a kid. I was a big fan of glitches as- oh, and then you can do that. Yeah, 
yeah, glitches were always a big, fi like, big thing for me as a kid. I always really liked them. Oh. I'm gonna go Bay. Forget you, Yoshi. The boss of Tricky Ruins. Oh! Hey! I know what mission this is. This one's really easy. There's a fun glitch you can do here. Every level starts off good when you know- You know a level's gonna be good when I say that. Serious good music. By the way, I can't hear the game right now. I know that that's just a me issue because I was the one who like unplugged the splitters to my capture card. But I can't hear the game. But I know this game so well. I know when every good song comes up. What can I say? I'm a bit of a Super Mario Sunshine fanatic. I'm a bit of a fiend for this game. some pretty cool movement. Okay, this one's interesting. So you grab this spring right here. And then let's see if I can get this first try. Oh! I did it. I fell, though. No! No, I forgot to hover! No! I forgot to hover. Chat, oh no. Well... That was almost really cool that I got it first try, but then I forgot to hover, and then I was falling too far. Well dang. So I'm gonna just do this. Get rid of this Pikmin cam. I need my voice to sound better, and so I'm moving my microphone towards me. This game's the best, you can spin jump in it. Screw Mario Galaxy, he doesn't have a cool spin jump. This game spin jump was so fun though, for real. That's what, probably part of the reason I like this game so much. It's just like, god the movement is so good. Can I do it first try again? No. <laughs> Second try? No. Well, dang. Please. Thank you. I remember to hover this time. Nice! Good, and now we don't have to fight Gooper Blooper for a third time. We can just go do that. Awesome. Five shines in... What? An hour and a half or so? An hour and one third? Pretty cool.
Red coins in a bottle. This one isn't actually that bad. From what I recall. I mean, if I can do this in like 10 minutes, I'll have an average of one star every 15 minutes. Which would be good. Huh. Doing this shine hoverless, I've heard, is terrible. I know that because I watched Game Champ do it, and she had a hard time with it. I also watched Psycho do it, who I mentioned last stream. Oh my god. Please. I'm gonna get this dang old red coin. Another red coin over here. There was one, right? Yeah. I remember. I remember. Hmm. Yes. I like how Mario can go backwards. That's one of my favorite features of my Mario. It goes backwards. See, that was so easy. I average one star every 15 minutes or so, give or take. What YouTubers is Mario Watch PewDiePie? No. I think that Mario would watch, like... Out of the YouTubers I know. Um, he's like 35, right? Mario just has PewDiePie on 24-7. You know what he would watch? I think he would watch, um... He would watch Twitch Plays Pokemon all the time. He would just have it running on his second monitor in his house. He would always bet on, like... He would always bet in blue. I need to watch more Twitch Plays Pokemon, I really like that. I like watching it. It's a fun little thing. Ever since they started doing PBR though, it, it's kind of like weird to watch it. Because it's like, well, I, I'm not here for PBR, I'm here for like, Twitch playing Pokemon. You know? Mario would watch those timber cutting compilations. So true, actually. Oh, it's this boss. This is that boss that I really hate doing. Well, fun fact though, you don't even need to like worry about getting eaten by it, because you can just shoot directly through it. Nice! Oh my god, that was actually so cool. Let's take a look. Oh, there's a blue coin right there, I need that. Yummy. Yummy blinds. Ooh, why not? I'll be taking that one, see? 
like a mobster doing that. Okay, here we are. This place looks so cool. I love how this place looks a lot. You can see it down there. You can only watch this stream late at night. This, this area is giving me a lot of late at night stream vibes, even though it's like 10 a.m. right now. This plus like the the GameCube over there. I seem to recall you being able to just do this. You know what? Wait, hold on. Can't you just? I'm gonna go take some coins. It's late at night for me. Scary stream. Good. As I said, that's the only way you can experience this stream. shoot just directly through this boss, trivia trivializing any and all danger you might need to put yourself in. Which is appreciated, because I do not like danger. It's crying. No, don't cry. Oh yeah, whenever you get hit by these, they they deal one damage, but then restore your entire HP. It's pretty funny. Alright, loser. Get ready to get your teeth cleaned. Who's ready to get their teeth cleaned? Who's ready to get their teethies? Cleansed. Who's ready to get their pearly whites washed? A spin. I can't tell if I'm doing any damage. I'm gonna go ahead and fly up there. Oh. Hmm. I'm gonna steal some of these coins. Oh wait, I only got two left. Hmm, okay, new idea. We're just gonna keep doing this. I'm gonna try to guesstimate where the teethies are. Right there? there and do it. Whatever. I got one more tooth left. Nice. Done. See, it worked mostly. That's the only time I had to actually go out and do it. Golden Toothy. Nintendo's gonna send their ninjas to attack you for this? They wouldn't do that to me, would they? Also cute circle of, like, coins. Cute heart of coins. That is cute. 
I wish I could go down further. Can you die if you go into the pit? Let's find out. No. Okay, thank God. Because I, I was genuinely going to go down there. And if I had to. If I had to die there, I was going to be very sad because I don't like doing that boss. It takes forever. Thank you. Forty-six. Would have been a funny bit, but I would have felt bad for making you do it. <laughs> it would have been funny, though. I don't know if I'm gonna do edits of this stream, of these streams, but I might. There's been a lot of good moments so far. Il Piantissimo Surf Swim? Is this that level where Chris O'Neill says, Julian, big scary man, come get you nighttime. On Oni Plays? I think it is, because I've seen that clip 40 trillion times. And I think it was on this exact level. Ah. Ho ho ho, foolish man. I wasn't ready, my guy. My camera was all turned around. Oh! What was that? Nice. He laid traps. He did. What is he up to over there? Dude's taking the most roundabout way to get over here, Jesus. Having a pleasant swim. He called me Clam Chowder. Chowder! Il Piantissimo would lay traps for you. Is it getting darker over there? I think it is. We need to fix this. Let me get some better lighting on this. I think it is getting darker because my book light might be dying. He's zigzagging to avoid the snipers that are after him. We'll get two more, and then I'll stop for now, probably, because that'll be ten shines. I don't know, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. The Shell Secret. Ooh, this is a class, this is a, this is a hard one. If you've ever seen the speedrun for this level, or if you have not seen the speedrun for this level, do yourself a favor and look it up, because it's insane what they do. Um... It's... The har it's genuinely- it's usually considered to be the hardest secret level in the entire game, and for good reason, because wow, this one is hard. I always love how much areas evolve in this game. Me too. It's such a cool thing. I love that they do that so much. Like changing the area up after every level is so neat. I am in love with games that do that. It's kind of why I don't like Mario Sunshine or Mario 64 because it. Because every area basically just stays the same. Like, yeah, some things change. Like, the water level, or, like, there's no more fog after the first level of Jolly Roger Bay. But, like, that's really boring. And lame. And dumb. Uh... Is 
that shell over there that has it. I don't think it is. <laughs> no! It's this one. Nice. Super cool. Okay. Oh, we're in the tank. We're in the Mario tank now. Huh. Are there blue coins in this level? What the hell? Oh no, that's just the rotating things over there. He's like a bug. You keep him in there. <sighs> oh, we're gonna be here a while. This level's infamously the hardest, like, secret level, like I said. This gives me Roblox obby vibes. Great. Uh, like, it's very vertical. And, like, a lot of things floating in the air. Like, of course other levels are like that, too. But this one especially, so... I don't know why. Nice. Okay, okay, peep this. What? It wouldn't let me wall jump there? I don't think Plot could beat this one. I don't think so either. Plot is quivering in his red little boots for this. Is there one up I can get? Nice. Nice! That was cool. I wanna hit this though. Wow, a coin. Just for me. You'd really do that for me, game? Clock speedruns are probably epic. I watched one the other day after watching um Nitro Rad's video on it. It was really good. God, that's so cool. Okay, we're not that far off. Oh, this one spins so fast. Oof! Nice! Actually, like really easy. That was actually the easiest level in this entire game. Um, yeah. <laughs> I love Charles Martinet for this game. Do you think people ever call him Charlie Marty? Absolutely. There's not a doubt in my mind. I'm astonished I did that so fast though. The power of the spin jump, baby. I love that thing. Speedrun? Hey yo! No, no, no. The speedruns for that level are so crazy. There's so much. Oh, he's sweating. Sweaty Mario. Oh, it's like this. Oh, 
Does not Miyamoto ever calls him Charlie Marty? Do you think Miyamoto and Charles Martinet are best friends? I feel like they should be. Have you ever heard Charles Ma Charles Martinet do uh, Bitrip Bitrip Runner 2's intro? That's one of my favorite things that he does. I love that that's just Charles Martinet. I think they're rivals. What, do you think Miyamoto thinks he does the better Mario impression? I like when they give Mario more like words to say. Where'd he go? There he went. Got him. Woo! Nice. Miyamoto secretly wants to voice Mario. I mean, I can't blame him. I feel like it's really, really dim now. Should I just turn off the webcam? Like, that's a really small amount of light. Hold on. Hold on. Yeah, no, I don't think this is gonna work anymore. I need to replace- the, I need to recharge it. Right, this uses micro USB to charge. I'm gonna charge it with my computer then. Hold on. Let me plug this in. I forgot this charges with micro USB, that's so funny. I don't know, we'll keep the webcam though, while it recharges. Okay, cool. So that's every... Every, uh, Noki Bay shine that we need. is there left to do? Oh wow, I've gotten so many sh shines. Cool. Okay, so Pina Park, Pianta Village, Gelato Beach. Those are the only three left, and then we're done with the game. I just need like a few more shines from each of those, and then we're done. Wow. You know, when I first streamed this a while ago, I wasn't expecting myself to actually like, finish it. I don't know, Mario Sunshine isn't a game I finish very often. I've beaten it like once. But I've started it so many times. More like Mario Dunshine. A up top. So, this level is actually really fun. I like this one because it's a vertical platformer. I'm kind of a big fan of those, as you guys are probably aware. I've made it clear very, very, very many times I like vertical platformers. Thank you. 
Oh, there's a bluebird there. I'll get that later. Um, however, we're not gonna do any of that. I wonder if you can actually, like, ride on top of us. That was not a spin jump. That was me trying to do a side flip. Okay, no, it just pushes you out. Look at this little man. So, this is the level we have to do. It's not that bad, to be honest. People always complain about this level, but I think it's really neat. <gasps> this level sucks. Oh, you can't wall jump here. That's right. Uh, but you know what you can do? You can do that. <laughs> Which is pretty awesome. So it's beautiful here. Whew. There we go. So now it's B to attack. Like I said before, I don't know if I mentioned this before, but the button for attacking and falling switches here. Depending on whether you're vertical or horizontal. Which really sucks. I hate that. Uh, yeah, that's really easy. Wow. I'm already done. So right here, if I press B, I fall, but if I press A, I attack. And I've messed up so many times trying to remember which is which. God, who made this? Uh, a bad video game maker. That's who. Somebody's bad at making video games. That rope down there is going insane. And now I will never be able to get on top of this Ferris wheel. This is always the hardest part of this level for me. I can do that part just fine, but actually getting onto these is so difficult. It doesn't feel like it's intended. I don't know. It just doesn't feel like you're supposed to be able to do that. Let me up there. Let me up there. Let me up there! Please! That was not a spin jump. Again, that was me trying to do a side flip. Nice. <laughs> Super cool. Fifty shines. We're looking good. We're looking very mighty fine, chat. I'll finish up Peanut Park. I forget what the next level is, but it shouldn't be that bad. I think Mario can win. Me too. Yoshi go around secret, yeah. Have I gotten all the blue coins yet? No, I have not. I don't know if I'm gonna 100% this game, I think I just wanna play the game. I like getting the blue coins because they're fun to collect, but... I don't know. Can I, like... Thank you. I'm about to get yanked. I'm really good. Mm, pineapple. Wow, this 
level looks really sun bleached here. Like this sidewalk, ah, that hurts my eyes. I'm sorry. I need to get a better capture card to be honest. My GameCube used to have like scan lines up here whenever I'd plug it in my capture card. Because it was a really weird it was a really weird issue that I had with it. Um because my my AC adapter for it was like kinda busted and bad and broken. To the point where like it could barely power on at certain points. Um it actually was not the AV cables that made the scan lines appear, it was the AC adapter. It's so weird. Oh, it's this level. Oh. Hmm. I have a hard time with this level. As I said, it shouldn't be that bad. I'm gonna get onto this next green platform. Oh. <laughs> Yahoo! Yoshi! This was a terrible idea! <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> that was almost so cool, dude! I spin jumped way too early. I spin jump. No, no. I pressed A too soon. It, like, the direction your spin jump sends you is depending on where your control stick is when you press A. Which sucks. Sometimes. Could you imagine if you could just have, like, complete control over your spin jump at all times? That would be so insanely cool. I don't know, I might get into modding this game just so I can see what that would feel like. Ooh! Ooh! Oh! If I get a game over here, I'm ending stream. But I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna get a game over. I'm gonna beat it this time. I'm gonna beat it right now. I'm gonna beat the level. You can't stop me. Huh? See, we're fine. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, well, goodbye everyone.